Hey guys, here I am at the SSWG Club the day before the great tournament and I'm here going to be speaking with Russell, the organiser. I'm just going to quickly show you the tables and go through a few bits and pieces. Um, they've all gone quiet actually, you can keep talking over there by the way, it's alright. Um, and we're going to get an idea of what's going on tomorrow. So, um, I'll have a quick word with Russell now and we'll get back to you. Okay, so this is Russell from the SSWG. What's him, how are you? Organiser of the big bolt action tournament. What's the name of the tournament? It is called Three Good Men. Three Good Men, excellent. Teams are free. Do you want to just talk us through the basic premise of the tournament? Yes, yeah, sure. We've got six teams coming along, uh, three men in each team, and they will play three rounds playing against uh, opposition. It's blue on red, so we've got three teams of the Axis, three teams that are allies. Um, there's nine tables. We rotate everyone around the table, so you won't play one mission more than once, you won't play on the table more than once. All the tables are set up for the missions, they're all ready, packs Brilliant. are there, so there's no confusion for anyone when, when they play. Sounds very In well theory. organised, you can see all the tables there look awesome. So you were just saying a minute ago yes. that each table is going to have a set scenario. Yes, this one for example is okay. called Tank Vandals. Yep. So it's, it's not a mission from the bot action pack, no, none of our missions are. Okay. Uh, we try and change them all so they're more interesting. So these missions that you've made up yourself personally? To, I'll be honest, put my hand up, this one we've made up, this is one of ours. Yep. But a lot of the others we take from the uh, Welsh Open. Okay. Because they do a really good job on missions, and we even credit them actually. Yeah, for the Welsh there. Yeah, they've done well. Firestorm Games in Cardiff. Oh, okay. Oh, Firestorm. So, yeah. I need, I need to get spears off them anyway. That's not like So yeah. So we do that. That there. Like this one, for example. Unusual. Instead of objectives. Yeah. There are tanks that are damaged on the table. Ah, I see. And you are bringing your engineers on to try and destroy enemy tanks before they're recovered. Okay. So these three chaps here are going to represent damaged enemy Axis tanks. Yeah. Allies will come on, with, preferably with engineers if they've got them. They put a down order on a unit next to the tank, okay. and at the start of the next turn they roll to see if their explosives go off. Brilliant. And if they go off, they get their victory points. So it's like taking an objective. And in the meantime, the Germans will be in the same to the Allied tanks, um, and we'll see uh, if they get similar results. Okay. So that's the plan, and uh, we'll see how it goes. Excellent, sounds good mate. So the rest of the tables have all got themes as well, I yes. take it? Yes, yeah, they're all themed. That's the only desert one. All the yeah. others, uh, we've got and the one city. And the people use the same army through each one? Or you were saying something about selecting the So what will happen, horses. what will happen is we, we take, say, say we take table one, two and three. So you, here you've got a railroad, railroad table. Yeah. You've got a city table over here. So this yeah. is an objective, objective table here with, for the railroad. Yeah. Uh, for the city one over here, which is meant to be Stalingrad, yep. um, that's a sector's mission. Okay. And then for the third table in the set, which will yep. be this one here, it's another objective's mission, but in a wood. Nice. So what happens is, say if uh, Team A is playing Team B, yep. they roll off, whoever uh, rolls highest will then look at Table A and they will get first choice on which army plays on it. Okay. The opposition, Team B, will then decide what army to put up against those guys. So there's a little bit of tactics there? A right? little bit, a little bit of tactics there. So that's a captain's choice? That's captain's choice. After they've done that, it's then Team B's turn. So they will come over to the Stalingrad table, yeah. pick their preferred army for it, and Team A will then match it. And then the final team, final two teams will be on Table C. Okay. So what will be interesting is if the captains are thinking properly, they will be thinking about all three games yep. and not just the first game. Right, yeah. So picking your army for just the first game, you have to be aware of what you're leaving yourself for the other two games. Yep. And that's where people might make errors. But we comp the lists people bring quite quite tightly okay. to ensure that they're fairly well balanced. That doesn't mean we won't get a mismatch, but we do everything we can not to. Okay, and that's, I, I take it that that's to say that um, they're, they're done correctly. Uh, you're not sort of suggesting that people will try and bend the rules? No, not, not, like not for an event like this, no. No, no but there are, there are certain things allowed in the rules. Yeah. You just um, want to make sure it's all fair and square. That's right, that's right. So the, the classic one is we will push back lists that take, say, two naval verfers or two katushas. Okay. Because that's a random weapon. Right. It can hit anything on a six. Yeah. And it, if it's effective and you roll a few sixes, it will completely change so the game. So in other words, rolling dice six is going to take, change that game beyond what too it much, normally. Too much. Yeah. Too much to our mind. So, good. so bring one, but don't bring two. Cool, excellent. So the other thing I've got to say is there's prizes, I believe, as well. Yes, yes. We're, we're very fortunate in that I... Uh, is Ian that Dan, Dan over there? Dan over there is prices. He's busy, he's busy working. Dan. <laughs> Doughty Dan, painting tanks. Hello, hello. So what are you painting, Dan? Uh, well, painting the prizes as well as uh, painting some of my own. Okay. Uh, just thought I'd get them all done. 
Uh, so we have a selection of prizes. It's like uh, Lynn there, mate, I'll look in on them, you're okay. Yeah, no worries. Yeah. Uh, we've got Yag Panther there. Which Always nice fun. to have a Yag Panther. Yeah, big beastie that I've just done it. And yeah. then we also have a M4 Sherman and a early variant of the Panzer IV. Very nice. Looking very nice as well. Thank you very much. So these are prizes for the players of Bolt Action. Yes. Well, you're not a great fan of Bolt Action, Dan, are you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dan's a battle grouper and he's going to be teaching me battle group next week. So Yes, definitely. Yeah. Well, he does like Bolt Action, really. I'm not going to say that. Yeah, it's where I started. Yeah. <laughs> Is that a good thing to say? It's where you started? <laughs> Uh, it's what got me into World War Two in a serious, on a serious note. Yeah. Okay. Remember, remember his face, everybody. That's Dan. Missions have got secondaries as well. Okay. So, so that there yeah. is a secondary objective. That there, right? So you get a bonus point. So if you get if you get a major win, you'll score five points. Okay. If you also get that, you'll get one bonus point for the tournament. Okay. So there is always a secondary mission. Got you. Which is worth doing because it adds up to the team total. So if you lose the five points, can you still get the bonus point? Yeah, 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 absolutely. Oh, right, so okay. you could, right. if you lose, if you lose, you score one point. Right. The, the reason we do that is if you can see the game, yeah. you get zero points. Okay. So it gives players, even if they've been overwhelmed, yeah. it gives them a reason to carry on. Right. And not to say, okay, I've had enough. Brilliant. Because they want that point. Yeah. But equally, if you realise you've lost the position, you yeah. might go, you know what? I'm not going to win this, but I'm going to grab that. Excellent. So instead of getting nothing from the game, you'd yeah. get a secondary. And it's the same on that one there. So the secondary is oh, I there. Oh, the yellow one. Okay. And yeah. all the other ones, that's the only one that's not yellow. All the other ones are those bright, luminous yellow okay. secondaries. 